close on this one. Take a little step for those reasons. That's why when we shot it, when they offered to have us shoot it at the U.S., I said, no, I got a better idea. Why don't you go across the street by the Brooklyn Bridge corner on the southeast corner across the street, and we'll have the U.N. in the background behind you, and that will be more epic. Really? <laughs> Guess what? It can't be brought to international court either. It wasn't shot on international soil, and we shot on U.S. soil. So there they can't you. even seize it that way. I had thought it through all the way, believe me. Dealing with them the last time taught me a lot. <laughs> I said, hey, you see working with them on Rock for the Americas with you and stuff. It was one of the most corrupt fundraisers <laughs> I've ever been involved in, only because I saw how much they were stealing. Well, it's No crazy. stealing this time. Companies are stealing from you in your future for today's profits. How does that feel? Companies are stealing from me? You didn't realize that? What do you mean? They're stealing your air by taking the trees. They're stealing oh. your water. They're stealing all your <laughs> yes. lifelines. This they're is stealing like, their owns the too. Millionaire. They're the millionaires making the money while they're taking our yeah. lifelines. They're going to go build a spaceship in outer space and take a ton of our air supply with them. But they'll run out eventually. So everyone will pretty much not be alive. <laughs> so that's, that's crazy. Don't steal air from yourself. You're just putting yourself in danger and your kids in danger at risk. At risk. Almost like a Rod Serling episode. Picture this, if you will. They came from far away, a journey, two planets. One looked like Earth, one was Mars. <laughs> but the next time they came, they were Gemini, because they looked alike. They Ooh. were the twins. How does that feel, Earth and Mars? The Gemini twins. That's crazy because I know with the sun we have several more years. Um, as we all have a long time because the sun will not burn out until a very long time from now. But the rainforest will disappear. And if the rainforest disappear, we all disappear. So with Mars and Earth looking the same in just a few years from now, that's, that's kind of scary because then humans will be extinct along with all the animals on this earth and life will not exist. Uh, when you guys are cutting this, I want you to index the first part um, and you'll feel it when you see it. And then the part about her mom and this last part. Um, one of those will go in the opening segment. Um, anything else we've missed? Hmm. Your, your, your message to the universe, to the gods and all the all the voices in between. My message is everyone should try to preserve the rainforest because the rainforest is what makes our heart beat every single day. It's what makes our lungs breathe. It's what, make, it's what makes us alive. So please join a help group or write your governor to help preserve rainforest. Her hair was up a little bit on the last part, oh, on right. the right side. Do you want to redo it or, or not? Was yeah, it? Could you, I, I, yeah, I, just put your right fingers to her one more time. Oh, yeah. Thank you. There you go. That's it. What we could what? do is have some wind blowing in the background, some trees <laughs> in the hair. Oh, no. <laughs> so do you want to recut any of that? Was it on the whole time? No, or just, just, that that last, just that last part. Still sticking out. Really? Oh, man. There you go. Okay. He just wanted but to touch no. I think I remember what I said. Doesn't matter. We'll we can we'll figure it out. We can always brush your hair down and so we'll digitally remove it. We're gonna have to do it again if we My message is to help preserve the rainforest. Write your governor, write a newsletter, um, plant a tree. The rainforest is what makes our heart beats every single day. And it, it's it's what makes our lungs breathe. So please Please help preserve the rainforest and just do anything that you can to help preserve paper or just plant a tree. Just, just do anything you can think of because life as you know it will be gone if we don't. Uh, anything else you want to run there while I'm taking a quick quick Um, That's all that can come to mind right now. <laughs> oh, that's an interesting twist to look at the fact. Were you taking a picture? Because I didn't know, so I just smiled. 
Uh, would you mind uh, taking a picture of us? No. Would you like to join us? Oh, yeah. Are you sure? I want to get one on my phone as well. I want to get my cigarettes off there. That's not necessary. Dad. Yeah, we need to. Should I cut or roll on this too? Oh, you can let her roll this one. Okay. We're, we're going to look for her. wacky outtakes anyway. I so, like your rainforest yeah. shirt. Uh, my ring for it's actually wow I didn't thought of that that way no way no I honestly did I just went and bought a bunch of um I love Hawaiian shirts I know I love I them. collect them and so I just went and bought a bunch awesome. more for doing the film I hadn't really saw the rainforest connotation but now yeah. that you mention it kind of does doesn't right? it right that's what I thought need like, my oh, shirts in my forest alone <laughs> Thank you for coming in today. Yeah, of course. Thank you Seriously. for having me. So I hope you can get your friends and other people excited about this film. Oh, yes, I definitely will. I'll be doing a lot of tweeting. And I hope people help us on the site to get this film done because it yes. really has been a lot of work. Uh, we hope to have it out before the end of the year and before the uh, emergency summit that's going on in December 9th in Paris. Oh, wow. That I have been asked to go speak before the UN and present the film. You should do it. No, they've changed their mind. What do you mean? They, they changed, they, I've been invited. Then they we did an interview you? with them. And they said some things they probably shouldn't have. And I've been uninvited. And they told me I can't use them in my film anymore, too. Oh, we'll, my gosh. We'll see about that, won't we? Uh, anyway, so <laughs> I may or may hey, not be... Don't smile for the camera. Oh, the paparazzi's here. I may or may not be in Paris before the UN General Council and Assembly on December 9th on the global warming. Guys, if the invitation is still open, I'll be there. And, and, and my special guest, Savannah, Savannah. Latham. Yeah, I'm down to go to Paris. Yeah, we're going to go to Paris and we'll join you. You know what? We'll go to Paris if the film is done on time, even though you guys are really throwing them a little monkey wrench to us. We'll go to Paris. And even if you don't want us to hang with you, <laughs> we can just hang out and let people come and join us on the red carpet. If you'd like to join us, we'll see if we can pitch you in. Um, <laughs> well, I mean, seriously. They Crazy. changed their mind because they didn't want us to tell the truth in this well, film. If they want to be alive in the next 10 years, tops. Um, they would invite five. you. Or five. Or two degrees. Oh, did I say it? We weren't oh, supposed yeah. to mention it. Either. Okay, so um, thanks for joining us on the set. <laughs> um, and thank you to the people who are working with us behind the scenes on making this a great film that will be coming to a theater near you if we have anything to say about it. And if I can get to a doctor and get this crack rib fixed, it really hurts. <laughs> thanks for joining us. Thank Live you. On set. Thank you. Thank Goodbye, you. Mom. We're glad you're well. Goodbye. Hey, can you make a picture? I'm just going to quit for you. Yeah. Uh, back. Really okay. I'll just make a shot there. Oh, One, she's touching my cracked rib. Two, oh, the tingles three. you're giving me. One, two, three. Gotcha. Thank okay, you. Okay, I'm here, wait. Yep. This one. I can send it to you if you want. Oh, no. We'll One. have different pixelations, different colors, different One, two, angles. One, two, three. Got it. Yay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh. Let's see the picture. Okay. Oh, that looks very nice. Good job. That's great. Would you uh, like to send this oh, to yourself? Oh, yeah. Can you send that to me? Sure. Just oh, I think my dad has like, a similar phone. Yeah. Is that the same one you have, Dad? 